Little Josiah Joseph suffers with cavernous hemangioma, a life-threatening disease. The two-year-old was diagnosed with a condition from birth. Cavernous hemangioma is a type of blood vessel malformation that has relatively large blood-filled spaces or cavities. In Josiah's case, it grows on his chin. Josiah's mother tells us the family has searched everywhere for answers, as they never gave up hope that their only son could once again have a normal childhood. It's difficult for him to play as a normal child would play, running and thing would be... He, he runs, he plays, yes, comfortable, but we always have to be looking at him at all times because if Josiah should fall and this should burst, there will be problems. It would, it's, it's vessels, blood vessels here that cross up here, so you know, he could bleed to death. She said she consulted a local pediatrician who told her that within three to four years, the hemangioma would dry up. But time passed by and the tumor on his chin continued to grow. When we go to the play park and think about him, you know, kids are always looking at him with pity, you know, so then like they don't really play with him comfortable. But everything changed when she came in contact with the Hope of Miracle Foundation. With their help, little Josiah will be traveling next month to the Jackson Memorial Hospital in Miami to perform the much-needed surgery. The entire operation cost 45,000 U.S. dollars. Their trip, financial assistance and accommodation made possible thanks to the Hispanic women in Trinidad and Tobago and the Hope of a Miracle program. The alliance that we have with IGF Wonder Fund, that is a program from the Jackson Memorial Foundation for the international patients, they respond very fast. And they help us a lot with the uh, medical fees. Since 2006, and with the support of private companies, the Hispanic women have returned healthy smiles to over 50 children, while at the same time bringing peace of mind to a parent, as this mother tells us. Since I've seen in the ad with Adia and Hope of America helping her and stuff, it really had brought light and a joy, you know, in my spirit. Funding is always an ongoing problem, the director says. But for those coordinating the fundraising events, this is a job they do with pleasure. The more that we, you know, we uh, raise funds, we can assist more children. Nisha John Mohammed, TV6 News.